for that sunshine, Beth. Yeah, wish the arrival was a little bit earlier, but I guess we'll take what we can get. There's still a couple of clouds here and there, but for the most part, we're starting to see that sunshine mainly off to our west. Live Guardian radar is quiet, a much different picture than it was yesterday. Yesterday, also a very warm day, we tied our record warm our, I'm going to say this right, our warmest low temperature for October 11th. We only dropped to 66 yesterday. The last time we did that, did that was 1879. Right now we're at 64 in Indianapolis, 75 in Terre Haute and 65 in Shelbyville. Most of us still experiencing those colder than yesterday conditions running 15 to 20 degrees colder than we were at this time yesterday. Those dew points are sitting in the 50s, also lower than what we saw yesterday. Yesterday was very sticky today, a little bit more comfortable. We've got this cool breeze about 5 to 10 miles per hour out of the south and those clouds are continuing to move on out of here, leaving behind some sunshine. It's not going to stick around very very long. There's a storm system off to the west, bringing snow to parts of Colorado and Wyoming, and it will bring some severe weather to parts of the Midwest, including Nebraska, Kansas, Oklahoma, and Texas. That storm system doesn't make it here until tomorrow afternoon. I don't expect severe weather with that in central Indiana, so we'll start off the day with a couple of clouds here and there but we will stay dry. As we go through lunchtime, we'll start to see those shower chances increase, and then by the afternoon, we'll keep those scattered shower and storm chances around. The rain chances do not end tomorrow. We've got more on the way Thursday and Friday. There is a marginal risk for areas up to our north and to our west for a stronger storm or two. I can't rule out a gusty or storm here and there in central Indiana, but we're not looking at widespread severe weather by any means. Here's those rain chances for Thursday and Friday. They do stick around what looks like early into the day on Saturday and then by Saturday afternoon that's out of here making for lots of sunshine and we get to keep that as we head into the day on Sunday as well. So here's what you can expect more rain chances that start tomorrow afternoon and continue into Saturday morning. Mild temperatures we've got 70s for the rest of the week 60s through the overnights. By this weekend things are cooler. We'll have 60s during the day and 40s through the overnight. More fall-like temperatures are on the way. 55 tonight, very comfortable, mostly starry skies. That's how we'll start off the day tomorrow with those increasing clouds. 75 by tomorrow afternoon with those scattered showers and storms, so make sure you've got the umbrella handy. Again, can't rule out a gusty storm or two. Rain chances continue into Friday, then we're in the 60s. Saturday and Sunday, more fall-like conditions. Monday and Tuesday of next week, they'll feature more in the way of sunshine and temperatures very seasonal. Bob.